Hey guys, welcome to the latest episode of <laughs> Cut to the Chase. Nice and tan too, by the way. Well, really? A uh, <laughs> couple of fake sunbeds, what can I say? In the middle of winter, you need a fake sunbed. But that's not what we're talking about today. Today we're talking about office, right? Because I'll tell you what, it's hard to, uh, they're hard to come by. Very hard to come by. You know, before uh, before there was uh, you know such a thing as people come in and come and give you an offer every, uh, for you know for every property basically on a weekly basis. Now, man, it's hard to bring the horse to the water, leave alone to get to drink the water. And when you get an offer, regardless of the amount of what the offer is, a lot of the time, you, a human instinct is to justify that it's a low Defend. offer, right? Hey, look, I know it's not a good <laughs> offer. It's, where, it's not where we end, it's, where we, it's, it's not where we start, it's where we yeah. end. And I think in this market, it's about, hey, we've got an offer, such a good news. This is the number, zip. Well, it's, it's that classic negotiation that good agents like, you know, top agents know, right? He who talks first loses. Exciting news, guys. I've got you an offer. Slip it forward. Say yeah. nothing. Like, yeah. you know, we've just come from a situation where we would, you know, someone was defending. Oh, I know it's a low offer. I know you're looking for more. Um, the, the, the buyer was looking for a bargain. So it's setting it up to fail immediately. So, yeah. Correct, correct. And, and you know, first thing that the vendor said in that meeting was, hey, look, it's, uh, it's, it's below the CV and all of that. And I think, you know, if you get an offer and it's below the CV, it's probably a good idea that you've got a couple of comparables already ready to quote that sold below CV. Um, oh, yes. So that, you know, it goes one with the other, you know, just the factual. I always say, every week I think I talk to, about facts, right? Have the facts ready so that whatever you do, you can, you, you can basically protect yourself that it's not you delivering the bad news, it's the market. It's the market. Those vendors sold below CV. These offers, it's, it's, it's a good offer. What do you think? Then let them say it's a bad offer, but unless it doesn't come from your side, right? Correct. And, and my, you know, our favorite one, I, I love it when people quote CV to me. I go, that's good. Ring up Auckland City Council and see if they want to buy the property. Does it come with a deposit? <laughs> Does it come with a deposit? Does it come with a deposit? No, check? it doesn't. So all offers are good offers. And the, the less you talk, the more success you'll have. And then you'll find out from owners where their true motivation are and do they think it's a low offer? Yeah. Because if you frame it up, they'll always think it's the worst case scenario. So, yep. Dave, it's good to see you. Cut to the chisel. See you next week. With bells on.